In the Supreme Court, justices deliberated for about 90 minutes on whether to make it harder for the Justice Department to prosecute those involved in the January 6th Capitol attack. The case, Fisher v. United, revolves around a law targeting those obstructing official proceedings, with over 1,265 arrests and about 330 facing charges. Arguments revealed a split opinion with concerns raised about the law's broadness potentially leading to overreach. Lawyer Jeffrey Green suggested a narrow interpretation, but few justices supported it. While many anticipate a favorable outcome for January 6th defendants, there's uncertainty about the court's justification. Green argued that the law's language should apply only to document-related obstructions, a view shared by only two justices. Justices debated the law's application, especially concerning the Capitol riot, acknowledging its seriousness while also questioning potential overreach. Concerns were raised about minor disruptions resulting in felony charges, prompting discussions on limiting the law's scope to avoid such issues. Judge Justin Walker proposed restricting it to those acting corruptly for unlawful benefits. Ultimately, the court's decision remains uncertain, with implications for future prosecutions of similar incidents.